All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am Sean Harrigan from The Cinescape, joined today by the wonderful Tia Carrere. Tia, thank you so much for joining us today. Hey, thanks for having me. We're here partying down at the Nostalgia Fest. Yes, we are at Nostalgia Fest 2017 in Ben Salem, PA. Also joining us is Greg Gorey. Greg, what's up, buddy boy? Not too much. Just hanging out with Tia Carrera. <laughs> it's awesome. So, Tia, right off the bat, you know, you are one of the most iconic 80s personalities probably here and ever. Uh, you know, your appearances in Wayne's World are just so, you know, incredibly awesome. And, you know, just the rewatchability factor on those movies are, you know, astronomical still today. Um, you know, what was your favorite part of being a part of those two movies? Well, wait, the uh, first correction is the 90s. Not 90s, the, sorry. Not the 80s. Don't age me, man. 92 and 93, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's got to be 90s. Now, they wanted me to do like this TV special on the 80s. I'm like, no, call me for the next decade. It's the 90s. <laughs> um, it's amazing to be a part of a film that is really more pop culture, you know, time capsule than film even. Um, though it was a great film, I think it was just that it coined all these phrases like, no way, way, or sha, as if, you know, Swing. Ex excuse me, um, excellent. I mean, people still use it today. Oh, yeah. People still drop to their knees and say, I'm not worthy, I'm not worthy. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's kind of funny that they did it with me because it's an Alice Cooper reference, but yeah. I'll take it. So outside of Wayne's World 1 and 2, what is your favorite performance that you've ever done or what is your favorite film that you've been a part of? Um, I loved uh, working with Arnold Schwarzenegger and Jamie Lee Curtis and the late Bill Paxton. Yeah. Holy cow. Oh, Unbelievable, man. He was something else. Um, yeah, on True Lies. That was a great film. A uh, huge film at Fox and... Uh, completely the opposite of my character in Wayne's World. Well, not opposite, but a different type of film. Yes, very um, much so. <laughs> you know, very different kind of film, but, you know, I was still you know, a kick-ass broad, which is pretty cool. So what are you up to these days? What are you working on? Uh, well, a little bit of trivia. I won two Grammys. Wow. Uh, I have four records that were nominated, and I got to perform at the Grammys, and... Uh, it was, I got to host there. It was pretty awesome. There's a pre-telecast, you know, before the 10 awards that you see on TV, there's a, where all the producers and the writers and, uh, you know, people like Coldplay and stuff get, right, you know, yeah. all, so I gave away a bunch of uh, amazing Grammys and got to perform there and took home a couple myself. So I have bookends. Oh, that's very awesome. And, uh, you know, we don't want to keep you out here in the cold too long, but is there anything, you know, that you haven't done yet that you really want to accomplish? Jeez. I mean, I'm a creative person, so I'd love to do like a stage show, um, you know, maybe do like a one woman show, talk you know, anecdotes about the career and doing music and I don't know, maybe pulling out one dance from Dancing with the Stars, just like a big entertaining show. So, yeah. Absolutely. Hey, we will be all for it. You know, we love you. You know, we've loved you for a long time and we'll continue to love you after that. So, Tia, thank you very much for joining us today and enjoy your time here in Ben Salem. Cool. Party on Toxic Radio. All right. That was awesome.